Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. This is uh, Jobert. <laughs> this is GN of GadgetPilipinas.net. Uh, well, marami sa atin ang gustong maglagay ng CCTV sa bahay. And uh, for you to be able to do that, you will need to spend about 10,000 pesos to 35,000 pesos depending on gano kadami ang CCTV na gusto mong ilagay at kung kailangan pa na may DVR at saka hard drive. Today we're going to show you a new product that SM Gadgets Hub sent us and this is the iFuture wireless home camera. And you know what? You don't need to spend 10,000 pesos because this one is its original price is 2,499.75 and this one only costs about 1,299.75 if you spend about 3,000 pesos at SM store. So, Ano pa gagawin natin? Let's unbox this and let me show you how it is installed. Alright, so this is uh, the retail box of the wireless home camera na binibenta uh, sa SM Gadgets Hub. Uh, of course, we're expe expecting this to be very easy to uh, uh, use. And uh, But before we do that, is uh, unbox muna natin siya. Okay, we have the camera right here. I think there's a, a box here inside. Yun, okay. So which includes, uh, there is, I think this is a mounting tab. If you want to mount this as a wall or however you want to use it, there is a charger. Actually, this is a charger, but uh, actually this one is the wall or the outlet where kapag ka gusto mo siyang isaksak, yan yung gagamitin natin. There is also a USB. This is a micro USB cable uh, that uh, attaches to the camera para siya ay gumana. And last but not the least, we have, of course, the uh, manual. So if you want to know more about how to use it, to navigate through and connect to it, if you want to be able to uh, review uh, whatever it took while you're away, then uh, this is the reference. But then again, we're expecting this to be very, very easy to use, then I don't think we will be needing that. Uh, for size reference, this is the Galaxy Note 10 Plus. So, ganyan siya kalaki. In fact, I have a, a, a plushie here of Spider-Man. Okay. Sobrang liit lang niya. And uh, despite the size, uh, this one can record up to 720p uh, resolution of uh, camera. Now, just to give you guys a quick tour, uh, hindi to pwede tanggalin. No? Uh, but uh, umiikot yan. 360 degrees siya, so we're expecting this na umiikot. Uh, this is the camera, the main lens of the camera. And uh, ito yung pinaka pang mount niya. So kung gusto mo siyang i-mount sa taas, gusto mo siyang i-mount sa gilid, or naka-mount sa, sa corner ng wall, I mean, not, it's up to you kung gusto mong gawin yun. Alright, so uh, I guess uh, that's pretty much everything inside the box of uh, the uh, iFuture wireless home camera. And this time, let us now set it up. Okay, first things first, this is uh, the uh, camera. So, tanggalin na natin yung uh, plastic. Alright, and then uh, the next thing we do is uh, isasaksak natin siya sa outlet. Again, this is not a charger but actually it's uh, an outlet. No? It's a DC outlet. So, saksak natin siya dito. And isasaksak natin ito sa outlet natin. And uh, kung makikita nyo sa taas, meron dito reset na button at saka meron dito na slot for micro for uh, micro SD. Uh, it is up to you. Hotspot for scanning code. Ayun, siya. So I have to scan down. Now, how do you connect that? We have here our smartphone. At ang gagawin mo is we're going to connect to the internet and download an application. And the application we're going to download, uh, it is called um, YCC365+. Plus. We're going to download that and uh, that would enable us to connect to our camera right here. Okay, so we have to register, uh, we have to sign up this on this application because there are other features that you can use no, with uh, this application. This is the confirmation email. We're just going to click that para ma verify natin yung pinaka account natin. And let us log into the app itself. So let's click addition of 8E hotspot and then we're going to press and hold set or reset key. Meron kasama siya na button or meron kasama dito na parang pin. So all you have to do is to insert that, press down the reset button. It will make a sound. Reset success. There you go. Go to setting. 
So, yung cloud cam, pupunta natin yung cloud cam. Please configure your camera by AP hotspot. Yun, okay, cloud cam. There we go. Kapag connect natin, confirm. Next. And then, choose the Wi-Fi. After nating mag-connect dito, we, parang nagawin niya is utusan natin yung camera to connect to our current internet connection. So, we will choose our HQ right here. We'll key in the password of our internet router. And then, yun, rinig nyo, no, may beep na tumunog. That means it is now connecting Please to wait for Wi-Fi connecting. Yon, connecting to our Please internet wait for router. Connecting. We're now at 13%. And this will take a while for about 1 to 2 minutes. And that's it. Addition is successful. It is very easy to use and we're going to click office kasi we're putting this inside our office. There you go. Okay, so now I can control the camera. Pwede kong tumingin sa harap. Mm, hello. Okay. Pwede rin sa kanan. And it is up to you because this one uh, should or should be able to record kapag may nakakonect na SD card. And that's uh, very important. Okay. Pretty cool for a uh, device that is not so expensive. It's 1299 during the promo period. And I think that it's a good purchase. Um, lots of uh, features available. Uh, may record button. Allow natin. So it's currently recording at the moment. So as you can see, it's not so difficult to set up. It is an affordable way for you to have a home monitoring system or camera at home. Kung gagamitin mo yan para sa anak mo, sa pet mo, or kung uh, whatever you want to see at your home while you're away. Or if you want to use it at your store, sa karinderia mo, o kaya sa tindahan mo, while you're away, you can do that. And with all the features available, like it has an application available for iOS and Android, para na sa ganon is if you have the internet, you can of course see what's happening while you're away live. So there's a direct feed via internet. But then again, if you have internet at home, you would be able to do all these really cool tricks with the iFuture wireless home camera. Now, how do you avail of this? It is only 1,299.75 pesos if you have a minimum purchase of 3,000 pesos at SM Store. The original price is 2,499.75, so doing the requirement during the month of October would enable you to buy this for a very affordable cost of 1,299.75. Mahal ba siya at uh, 1,299.75? I don't think so. Yes, iba naman yung ino-offer ng mga 10,000 peso worth na CCTV or even more than that. But then again, if you want to start off small, this is something that you might want to check out. It's a good investment if you have either a fiber at home or not. This is actually fit for your needs. Again, I hope you guys enjoyed yung ating unboxing ng uh, iFuture wireless home camera. And I uh, hope you guys enjoy this. Hope you learned something about this. And see you soon. Sana makita ko kayo sa SM Store this October. Again, this has been Gian of Gadget Pilipinas. Thank you for watching.